ever wondered what happened to those sweet, innocent child stars once their big roles were over? Fair warning, some of these may shock you. Number five, Carrie Hen. Carrie Hen began her acting career at the age of 10 by portraying Newt in 1986's Aliens. That was her first and only role, even though she received praise from both public and critiques. Even winning the Saturn Award for Best Performance by a Young Actor, Hen did not find herself in the Hollywood, leaving it all behind with a simple statement that simply acting was not her passion. After quitting her acting career, Hen pursued a degree in education, earning bachelor's degree in liberal studies from California State University. Ever since, she has been following her dreams and working as an elementary school teacher in small town in California. Number four, Jeff Cohen. Jeff Cohen is best known for his role as Chunk in immensely successful 1985's comedy, The Goonies. To this day sequence from that movie known as Shuffle Truffle is imitated and used in various media. After hitting puberty, Cohen lost a lot of weight and as he was known as Fat Kid in the industry, acting opportunities started drying up, which forced him to retire from the acting at the age of 17. Once he realized that his acting career was over, Cohen decided to become a lawyer, which oddly enough allowed him to stay part of the show business, as he specialized in becoming an entertainment lawyer, which brought him great success as he was named in the Hollywood Reporter's list of top 35 executives under the age of 35, as well as in Variety's list of dealmakers. He also writes for the Huffington Post and CNBC about business, legal and political matters. Number three, Danny Lloyd. Danny Lloyd is a retired child actor best known for his role as Danny in the Stanley Kubrick's adaption of the Stephen King's classic horror novel, The Shining. Considering the fact that this movie was the pinnacle of his career and numerous unsuccessful auditions after The Shining, Lloyd decided to quit acting altogether and focus his attention on academic endeavors. In 2004, Danny Lloyd became an associate professor of biology at prestigious community college in Elizabethtown. He is still working as the professor of biology and you can find him on Rate My Professor website, where most of the students rate him as an awesome professor. Number two, Dylan and Cole Sprouse. Although technically not retired from acting, Dylan and Cole Sprouse definitely took breaks from acting to explore other paths in life. Both of them have spent their entire lives acting. Their acting careers began when they were only one year old. Now, they are best known for their work on mega successful show, The Sweet Life of Zack and Cody. When they took their break from acting, both brothers decided to try to live normal lives in 2010. They were accepted to attend New York University, where five years later, Cole earned a degree in archaeology and Dylan earned a degree in video game design. Cole Sprouse successfully used his degree and briefly worked as an archaeologist, while Dylan Sprouse first worked as a waiter, but later on in 2017 decided to open his own meadery called All Wise Meadery where they produce deliciously sweet mead. As of 2023, it appears that both brothers have returned to acting in major ways, receiving praise and admiration for their various roles. Before we reveal the last one, make sure to like, share and follow in order to help us make more great content for you. Number one, Taylor Momsen. It may come as a bit of a shock that sweet little Cindy Lou Who from Christmas Movie, How the Grinch Stole Christmas, is neither sweet nor little. The 30-year-old actress now spends her day in the studio, making alternative hard rock music as a lead vocalist for the band called The Pretty Reckless. She explains that she decided to quit acting and focus on music because acting is easy. I've been doing it for so long and I totally love it but you're playing a character instead of yourself. Music is more personal because you're writing it and you're involved in every step of it. Her acting career ended with the release of last episode of Gossip Girl all the way back in 2012. Now in 2023, Taylor doesn't seem to be interested in returning to Hollywood anytime soon as she is enjoying her life as a musician. 
Thank you very much for watching this video. Please make sure to like, share and follow in order to help us make more great content for you. See you